Welcome back soldiers to another Ponky update. And yes, Ponky has dropped a validator. It's big news. It's gonna help a lot of people. It provides opportunity to multiple demographics within the cryptocurrency community. So we're gonna talk about it. Right now it is February 17th. 12 17 a.m on the west coast this is not financial advice i'm not a financial advisor so please do not make investments based on what i say in these videos but you guys already knew that because you are accountable adults and i trust you with that much all right check this out the validator by ponky i'm sure you guys can recognize this imagery from a video that was dropped couple of weeks ago. So the URL is validator.ponky.xyz slash hashtag roadmap. And it says a Solana validator for the people earning rewards for your contribution led by a community of degenerates. So right off the bat, you can tell that the website is professionally done. I love the branding. I love the logo. I love the look. And keep in mind, this is just one of multiple Ponky products. You also have the buy bot, it's called Meme Trend Bot. So you can click my link in the description below to try that out. A bunch of people are using it. I gotta let you know it's in the beta version. So there might be a few bugs, but I have checked it out and it's working fairly well. So click my link in the description below, also the pinned comment. And this is just another product, all right? You also have the third one, Meme Trend which is a decentralized app. I like to think of it as like a 2024 MySpace for cryptocurrencies. It's just the way I think of it. Like each cryptocurrency is gonna have its own social media profile and it's gonna have a bearish to bullish indicator that is generated using artificial intelligence to gauge the sentiment uh, that is that is propagated throughout the internet. Um, so you're gonna have this indicator as opposed to reading tweets from all these people that you don't know if it's credible you don't know um you don't know if you can trust it right if you should do more research or whatever you're gonna have ai generated sentiment tracker for cryptocurrencies amongst many other things that was just a feature that i thought was cool but back to the validator i will let you guys know that i have like zero knowledge about what a validator is this is my superficial understanding of it okay so you can stake solana or possibly other tokens i'm not entirely sure but basically you put that aside you put that liquidity aside that helps transactions get processed within the solana ecosystem so swaps buys and sells and then because you are doing that, you are helping secure the network, you get rewards in interest or APY. And I don't know the exact percentage interest, and I think it's going to change over time. Uh, I've heard it's based on the performance of the network. So I don't want to say anything and, and like really not know what I'm talking about, because if I don't know what I'm talking about, I just won't talk about it but I know that much about a validator. Um, I know it's gonna bring a lot of utility to the space. So I'm not gonna go over the whole thing and just bore you guys and just read off a screen. I want you guys to, to find it out on your own and do your own research as well. You got meme trend launch imminent. So that's probably a little bit less than three weeks away around there, meme trend, really stoked for that. You got the validator, you can see here it's running, fully operational, ready for staking, 100%. And then you have FAQ right there. So big news was dropped earlier today. Super stoked on that. Let's take a look at the chart right here. You got it trading at 0 0.02776 USD. That's a market cap of $15.4 million. This is just another reason why I said three cents is not the resistance level to break. And I'm going to show you why. Okay. So how many times has price came up to this three cent zone once, twice, three times, and this is the fourth time. I don't know why it's drawn in red. Let's draw it in yellow. So four times in the past, what is that? Uh, seven days, it's came up to that three cent level and just got rejected. So that's why I don't see that level as the resistance level to cross. Um, I see three and a half cents as more telling 
of the market choosing a direction after that. I think above three and a half cents, there's not much, uh, not much friction, not much sludge, not much resistance, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to pull up the volume profile and see if that adds confluence to what I'm speaking on. We're going to do a VPV yards, volume profile, visible range. All right. So we're going to zoom back in. Now we have all the price action in view, all right? So these bars on the right show you where most of the volume in transactions occurred, all right? So you can see you have a lot of thickness in, um, let's see, from five and a half all the way down to mm, roughly two and a half cents, all right? That's where the bulk of the price action has occurred. And if you look back, it rings true because really the, these pushes up, uh, this one right here and this one right here were outliers in terms of price action. So let's take a closer look again. Um, okay, so you can see right here, immediately this, uh, this shelves down from 0 0.032. And then after that, um, it significantly drops down with the volume. And then this next level would be right at where my resistance level is at. And so I put this white line here, I put it there like a week or two ago, a long time ago. I put it there because it's like, okay, after we clear this hump right here, it's fairly smooth sailing. And then at that point, I think FOMO is going to kick in and uh, I think you're going to see some pretty big buys. But that's just what I think, all right? So that's what the chart is looking like. I think once Ponky clears three and a half cents, it's going to fly. You got meme trend right here, dot XYZ. I told you that's coming in roughly three weeks. You can try out the buy bot right now. It's in my link in the description below. I encourage you to do that. I gotta let you know again, it's in the beta stages and so there might be a few bugs. I gotta let you know about that. And then uh, they announced their day five winner. So congrats to Dante. They won $300 worth of CBDC. Dude, $300, if you invest that correctly, that could change your life. And, and we spoke on, um, I, I, I choose my words carefully because I, I don't ever want to tell anyone what to do uh, with their money because I don't care and it's not my money. But we were talking about the idea of trading versus investing. And you have the bull run starting to pick up now. We're not anywhere near the thick of it. But we were talking about, you know, rotating from different coins to different coins. And especially in the meme coin field, it's like we all know 99.9% .9 of those die within 24 hours or less, especially on Solana because there's virtually zero gas fees. So I was speaking on it's usually much more effective to find something early it's always about getting in early like whatever you're doing trading or investing but find something early that you think is going to have longevity like that's it and i know it's really general and uh i'd like to keep it that way but um i'm telling you most traders lose in the long run and i explained this in a previous video because unless you're a whale with mul uh, multiple millions of dollars in capital you're not moving the chart. You're reacting to whales moving the chart. So you're always gonna be late. You're always gonna be late to get positioned to be in a place to take big profits. So rewind that as many times as you need to to understand it. But that's why over 90% of traders in the long run lose money. So um, hopefully you guys understood what I was trying to get across right there. And then this is the, the tweets about the Solana validator. So the total stake supply of Solana is 382 million soul. That's worth $43.4 billion. Practically 67% of all existing Solana is staked. That's over two thirds. And for a good reason, the world's third largest and most active blockchain has become the center of the crypto world's activity. And like the inner DGENs we are, we decided we wanted to get a piece of the action. So they dropped the validator. Huge, man. Absolutely huge huge all right team vision for for uh for ponky right here generate revenue stake profits use rewards for buybacks so the entire thing is is, is going back to the community of ponky
um, or at least, you know, a percentage of it, but like the, the mission behind it, right? The objective, the overall goal. So you guys can read the rest of it. I don't want to bore you. Uh, love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you for tomorrow's update. Peace.